Hiya and welcome to Tokyo Treat unboxing for October 2020. Um, so this actually arrived this morning and it's the 18th of October. Ah, oh, no, it was the 17th of October because we've gone past midnight. Beg your pardon. So let's have a little look. I've been at work, so I'm on late. Okay, so that's Tokyo Treat Community, our little booklet. Um, we've got a couple of little flyers and the important stuff. So what have we got? I would gather it's another, yep, yeah, it's a Halloween theme, of course. That's normal. Um, and still been. They do a uh, premium box, classic box. I always have the premium box because you get the drink and other bits and pieces, which is really nice. Um, still been. So we've got a Halloween caramel corn. I, I've liked every one of the caramel corns so far. So I'm pleased to see that one. Um, oh, sorry about the light on there. Um, this is pumpkin pudding flavour. So not the biggest fan of pumpkin, but I would imagine it was quite sweet. There we are. We've got some focus going on there. That's better. Um, so yeah, we we'll definitely look forward to trying that one. The next snack. That looks like it's something chilly, doesn't it? Does that look like that's going to be something rather mean? Looks like it to me. So this is an Ambulo Rings Mental. Mentai. Okay, yeah, we need to add a little heat to our hungry, hungry Halloween. Yes, don't you just. That looks proper mean. The crunchy corn snack is perfect, slightly spicy. Treat to shake up your sweet snack party. But it looks mean. And I'm a wuss. I'm the biggest wuss when it comes to spicy. Oh, look at this. How cute is this? So, I've had this brand quite a few times and they've been really yummy. Um, so, where's this one? Mm -mm -mm. I can't see it. Oh, it's a Pokemon. I thought, I wondered if it was. What is the name of that one? Scar. Scar Marie. Scar Bunny. Scar Bunny. Oh, my days. Because it's one of the newer Pokemon. So. But it doesn't quite look like. Pokemon Halloween Party Spooky Collection features Pikachu-shaped chocolate corn snacks. Perfect for tri trick, and trick or treating. Oh, I would like to have had Evie. Look at Evie. Love Evie. My, one of my favourites. Scar, Scar Bunny? Something like that? I think. What have we got here? Chip star soya sauce. Mm. Oh, it could have been one of three. So it could have been Ton Yam Kong or a mystery flavour. Oh, I wish I had a mystery flavour or soya sauce. I would like the mystery flavour. I wonder what the mystery flavour was, which I wouldn't know. But I'm kind of glad that. I haven't got the Tom Yan Kung because it's a spicy seafood. But I'd like seafood, that's for sure. But hey-ho. All right, we've got a little ghosty Halloween trick-or-treat. Looks like a corn snack there. Where we got that one? Oh, Halloween pizza flavour. That sounds yummy. I'm looking forward to that one already. Um... What have we got now? Upside down and trying to disappear. So, oh, we've got one of the stamp ones. I've had these before. They actually taste like quite nice. They, they last forever. Um, and if you lick them, you can actually put a stamp on your hand, which is, of course, very grown up of me. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, that's Monster Stamp Ramoon. And, yeah, just stamp. 
a ghoulishly cute design and they, they, they're tasty actually so that's cool we then have which i've had this one before as well some chewing gum i know that is and it's a monster monster gum energy flavor um it there's some are sour and it's a surprise which one you're gonna have and the sour one is really sour so. now this i am without a doubt so looking forward to trying um this is our kit kat one and it's an apple pie flavor kit kat and that sounds absolutely delicious so definitely looking forward to that and there's the, i guess the normal 12 pieces in there yeah yum yum so i've got a blue fish not keen on the fishes so far um berry zombie fish shaped wafer in berry flavor chocolate so they're quite big as well actually all right so what we've we got here oh which way which way round little ghosty in a witch's hat happy halloween and where have we got this little fella where are we going mm -mm -mm. Because it says that there's a mystery snacky. So it could be this one. It feels waferish, I don't know. Like um one of those it's almost like candy floss in the middle, which are really nice. Um oh this little man's got a pint of beer. He's a sensible fella. Any man with a pint or lady with a pint of beer, sensible peoples. So this is mass, uh, maple butter beer ramoon candy. Okay. Uh, candy will fizz away in your mouth and dissolve like magic. Just like beer when it goes in my mouth dissolves like magic. <laughs> Okay, we got a little soda pop fella going there. Where's this one? Here it is. Grape soda gummy. A refreshing sour grape gummy. Lovely. Very nice too. A little rattly Frankenstein. And this is a Frankenstein gum. Tasty soda flavour gum will turn your mouth green. Give it to your friends as a prank. <laughs> then we have one of the little Halloween marshmallows. These marshmallows are normally really nice. They've got something in the centre. Uh, where's a marshmallow? Mm -mm. There it is. Halloween pudding marshmallow. Sweet marshmallow. They're normally nice. They don't last long. <laughs> They're normally very nice. So then, what's this one? Mm. Some sticky things. So where's this? Uh, uh, uh. There they are. Oops. Oh, sweet potato. Can't pronounce this. Curry satsuma sticks. You know that's wrong, don't you? The packaging might be giving away a scary look, but inside you find taste of surprise, crunchy pets, pretzel snacks with a sweet potato flavour baked right in. Okie dokie. So then, oh, we've got another. What's this one? Little bat. We don't like bats, do we? So have I got it wrong? So that we've definitely had. That's we've definitely had. That, yep. That one, that's a Pokemon one. Oh, here we are. Ghoulish gummies. Um, 
I've had a few spooky sweet gummies. Yeah, so that's that one. So we've had all of that, just making sure that that one we don't really know what is in it is the surprise one, which appears to be so. Yeah, and lastly, we have a Where's Wally creme brulee Lipton drink. And I've already had one of these. And I haven't tried it yet because it is a bit of a funny colour. And I'm not very brave with things that are a bit of a funny colour. Um, <laughs> it's caramel flavour, limited edition Lipton milk tea. will keep company on scary nights. Not to be missed this spooky season. So there we are. That's October's Tokyo treat. Um, yeah, it's not bad, to be perfectly honest. I'm definitely looking forward to Kit Kats and the pring pringly things. So, yeah, actually quite good. So please like, subscribe and visit again. Cheers.